And then another organization that needs our help yes. is Feed More Western New York. We absolutely love them. To yes. be able to help them is actually our honor. So yeah. we are inching closer to the time of year where we hear a lot about yeah. Feed More's need to feed. But what you may not realize is that this mission is one that spans 365 days a year. Kat, thank you so much for inviting us again to Feed More Western New York to talk about the need. Because as we were talking about earlier, the need is constantly changing, but it's always there. So can you talk about the current need? Well, absolutely. And, and like you said, hunger has been a really long-standing problem here in Western New York. And unfortunately, right now, what we're looking at is we are 25% higher in terms of our food insecurity rate right here in Western New York mm -hmm. than we are for the entire New York State. Um, so there are there's a tremendous need. So it's really important that you mention that because Food insecurity is all the time, but we're heading into some really tricky months. This is the holiday season, and you're gonna be having requests from so many more people. So if you could talk about being able to help now more so than ever, and how that's so important. Well, you're exactly right. You know, the holiday season is really a time at Feed More Western New York when we see our numbers climb in terms of those who are reaching out for food assistance. Um, it can be a really tough time of year for so many people, and we know that inflation is really only making things worse. Prices are going up in terms of cost of living, in terms of what we're spending at the grocery store, Right. store and in terms of what we're spending in gas to get to work. So um, we do anticipate a lot of people reaching out October, November, December, mm -hmm. and that's why events like our upcoming Walk Off Hunger event and events like food drives, volunteer opportunities for Feed More Western New York are really critical. We do need all of the support in terms of uh, funding, food donations, and those volunteer support to make sure that we are fighting hunger here in Western New York and making sure that hungry children, families, seniors, veterans, all of people who are struggling with food insecurity do not have to go without nutritious food. If you had to speak to those people out there who are maybe on the fence about helping because they think, oh, Feed More Western New York is a great organization, they've got it handled. What do you have to say to them about the importance of helping out when you can? Well, you know, I hear time and time again uh, from people, I was just on the phone with a gentleman who was 50 years old, he had lost his job, and he was telling me with so much emotion in his voice, I never expected to need to go to a pantry. This was not my plan. This was not my wife and I's plan. Um, but, you know, there are so many unexpected circumstances. There is job loss. There is just people who are living paycheck to paycheck as it is, and as the cost of living, living climbs, um, they have to make some really tough decisions. I talked to uh, grandparents who have had to take in their children unexpectedly. Mm -hmm. I have talked to high school students who unfortunately are, are looking at do I have to drop out of school um, in order to get a job to help feed my younger siblings? This is stuff that we hear all the time at Feed More Western New York. And the one thing I stress is that it does not pertain to a certain zip code. It does not pertain to a certain demographic or a certain population. Um, there is really no one face of hunger. And, and here, right here at Feed More Western New York, we're serving people throughout our rural communities, our suburbs, and our cities. Um, so if you are in a position to help Help. We really encourage you to get involved and know that you could be helping your next door neighbor, you could be helping your child's classmate or your coworker. So where do people go if they say, I need to help, and you can help in one of those many ways that you were just explaining, where do they go for the most up-to-date information? Well, one great way is you can reach out right on our website, feedmorewny.org. That is a really great option. You can sign up to volunteer. You can make a donation right online. Mm -hmm. You can sign up and register for events like our upcoming Walk Off Hunger fundraiser. Um, so you can find that and so much more at our website, feedmorewny.org, mm -hmm. or you can call us, 716-822-2002. Those are great ways to get involved, and also if you find yourself in a position where you need to ask for help. Again, visiting our website, calling us at 822-2002, both wonderful ways to get involved. Kat is amazing. And thank you so much to her for explaining what we need to know about the need here in Western New York as well as how you can help feed more. All the folks at Feed More Western New York are amazing souls. Yeah. So oh thank you gosh. for what you do. Yeah, and after the break, we walk you through step-by-step step how you can get involved and be a sponsor for Walk Off Hunger. You are watching AM Buffalo. Stay with us. <laughs>